Rolling. Okay, guys, this here's the uh, in field review of the uh, Delorme Earthmate PN40. Um, supposedly, you can submerge this thing in about three or four feet of water and it'll still work. Uh, haven't done that yet. It's got the uh, electronic compass, which is pretty good. It gives you your um, your coordinates, longitude, and longitude, uh, your speed, your heading. Next page does pretty much the same thing. Uh, we've only been hiking 1.57 miles in Africa heat weather. Uh, let's see, been hiking about an hour and a half. Max speed it says 99.8, but I used the uh, GPS on my 550 cord to uh, kind of take out some spider webs. So average speed is about a mile, mile and a half uh, per hour. Next page has the uh, satellites. Uh, I'll show you how many satellites here you have in green. The blue I think are, uh, I guess they're trying to acquire a satellite. It's got a little picture up there where each satellite is, uh, which ones we're locked into up here. It's got the uh, time, of course. Battery's down to yellow. Um, I've got some Duracell, um, what are they, NICAD? Not NICAD, uh, alkaline batteries in here. And uh, we've been hugging an hour and a half and it's only down to yellow, so that's not too bad. I'd imagine lithium batteries probably do a little better. Next page. Um, you can kind of see like where we've been. Uh, started out down here at the trailhead and uh, got about a mile and a half. I got some geocaches on here too, so. But uh, it's pretty cool. I mean, when, it, when you turn it, the arrow moves as to which way you're moving. But, uh, so that's that page. Then you go back to the magnetic compass. This thing is so easy to use. I mean, let me go back to that page. I want to mark right here. I just hit this little thumbtack. I want to uh, mark right, mark our location. I just hit this little pin mark, pin uh, button, and that'd be it. Uh, if I want to know how many miles or how long it was going to take us to get to the next, uh, say geocache or whatever, I can use these uh, this little thumb pad. I can go up and use my arrow. There's a geocache, and right up here. It says we're about 1.27 miles from it. So that's pretty cool. Then to get back to your page, you just hit your page button until it goes back to your normal uh, your route. Um, on the back, this big uh, thing up here is where you plug it into your uh, computer through a USB port. And uh, it works really good. I like it. There's been a couple firmware updates for this. And um, uh, I've applied those, so it's got the latest uh, updates and settings. This unscrews. This is a, uh, a water, like I said, it's waterproof. So, uh, little things, man. See, I don't have any fingernails, so it's a little hard. <laughs> but, I do have a knife. Like I said, behind here, you've got uh, your batteries. And uh, underneath that, I'm, I'm not gonna take these out because we uh, I don't want to re recalibrate everything and lose our position. But under there, I've got a uh, four gigabyte memory card. And uh, so that's where that goes. You can easily change it out. So it's been pretty accurate so far. We've uh, checked out with some compasses and stuff. And, uh, the magnetic uh, electronic compass is pretty good. Um, so. We're gonna keep on keeping on. It's about a, uh, I wanna say this GPS cost maybe $300, $350, somewhere from there. Um, like I said, it's bright orange, so in case, I mean, if I drop it on the ground, it's gonna be easy to see. I mean, I've seen some of these camouflaged uh, GPSs. I don't even know why the heck they're making my color. Because if you drop it, you may not find it. Like I said, with this one here, it's waterproof. You can uh, submerge it under, uh, three, four feet of water and still be all right. So that's our review on the uh, Earthmate, the Delorme Earthmate PN40.